Welcome or welcome back to Barrio Tales. Today's video will be about an incident involving Eastside Wimas and Rancho San Pedro. On July 18th, 2015, a baptism party was held in Wilmington. The party host was the girlfriend of a Rancho San Pedro gang member named Ronald. A second couple who attended the party was a woman and her boyfriend, another Rancho San Pedro gang member. The woman from the second couple had a child whose father was a member of the Eastside Weemaw Street Gang, one of Rancho San Pedro's rivals. Shortly after midnight, the party host, her Rancho San Pedro boyfriend, Ronald, and the woman from the second couple drove to 25th and Leland Street to San Pedro. The party host asleep in the back seat was awakened by gunshots. The woman from the second couple was shot in the leg and her Rancho San Pedro boyfriend was shot in his left shoulder. A nearby resident heard approximately five or six gunshots. He saw a man shooting at a parked car. Another man was nearby. The two men ran down the sidewalk. Someone said, We must. The two men entered a dark gray car and sped away with tires screeching. Minutes after the shootings, Rocket, a.k.a. Yvonne Hernandez's mother, texted Pinky, a.k.a. Alberto de Jesus Ramirez, and asked if Hernandez was with them. Ramirez responded, yes, he is. About an hour later, Chiquito, a.k.a. John Gilbert Alvarado, texted Ramirez that he was home. Ramirez texted that he and Hernandez were home and warned Alvarado to be careful because police were everywhere. Two days later, July 20th, 2015, several San Pedro residents observed two men chase Jose Pineda on the 13th Street sidewalk. Pineda had an RSP tattoo in the back of his head and a rancheria tattoo on his head or body. One of the men screamed, where are you from? A few seconds later, shots were fired. One man appeared to be wearing gloves and shot a man with an extended magazine clip and a long barrel using his left hand. John Gilbert Alvarado was left-handed. Jose Pineda fell to the sidewalk. One of the men walked up to Pineda and shot him three or four more times. The two men ran down 13th Street toward the alley. Rancho San Pedro gang member Jose Pineda died of multiple gunshot wounds. He had at least nine gunshot wounds, including wounds through his neck, arm, stomach, liver, lung, and brain. Surveillance video from a nearby apartment showed two men walking south in the alley toward 13th Street and later running north in the alley. One wore gloves and held a long handgun in his left hand. At the scene of the shootings of the woman who had a child with an Eastside Wemos gang member, but during the time of the first shooting was in a relationship with a Rancho San Pedro gang member, police recovered 28 shell casings and two expended bullet rounds, all fired from a 9mm firearm. At the scene of the Pineda murder, police recovered 23 9mm toll ammo shell casings fired from the same gun as the shootings of the first shooting of the two women and one of their Rancho San Pedro boyfriend. Also found was 380 caliber casings. Some of the 9mm casings were just inches from Pineda's body. The number of 9mm casings suggested the gun had an extended magazine. A search of Yvonne Hernandez's home recovered a sweatshirt with writing on it that matched the one in the surveillance video, gloves, a 9mm toll ammo round, and a 380 caliber round. Yvonne Hernandez confessed to police that he was one of the shooters in both incidents. Regarding the first shooting, Hernandez said the party host woman invited him to the party and he and Albert de Jesus Ramirez attended. At the party, he saw Ronald and other enemies from the ranch. He felt threatened because they were looking at him funny and had threatened his family by passing by his house. He wanted to get revenge. After the party, while driving Ramirez's great Kia, Yvonne Hernandez recognized two men from the party. He parked the car, walked over to them, fired 10 to 15 rounds at them, then ran back to the car. Regarding the murder of Jose Pineda, Yvonne Hernandez said he and a friend were cruising around San Pedro looking for Ronald. Yvonne Hernandez was wearing pants with a long belt. They saw Pineda, who banged on them and was throwing up R's and shit. Pineda did not have a gun. Hernandez got out of the car and shot five rounds from a 22 caliber gun. Hernandez said he and his friend shot at Pineda but did not shoot him and did not kill him. Police conducted a Perkins operation in which John Gilbert Alvarado was placed in a cell with two informants posing as gang members and a recording device. Portions of the conversations were used as evidence. Alvarado said he was Chiquito from Eastside Wimas. There was tension with fools from Rancho. 
a fool from Pedro was with a homegirl. That fool and fools from Rancho were entering Alvarado's hood. Alvarado said he and Rocket asked Pineda a question. Pineda responded, Pedro. Pineda's hands were in his pockets. Alvarado admitted shooting that fool from Pedro about 25 times with a 9mm gun, including about 7 times in the head and 7 times in the neck. Alvarado said he was the lead. He and Rocket used a Glock 17 and a 380, both with extended burners. Alvarado had two extendos. He made sure he was dead in my face when I walked away, Alvarado said. Alvarado admitted he was the person running the surveillance video. He said police also showed him pictures of Rocket. He said police showed him the sweatshirt he wore and he fucked up by not getting rid of it. Alvarado said the driver, Pinky, was from the hood. Alvarado said they all felt happy after the shooting. During Yvonne Hernandez's questioning, police used things like family at home and younger siblings as a reason that Yvonne should tell them what had happened and that if Yvonne was honest, maybe they could help Yvonne. Yvonne made incriminating statements. A gang expert testified if a woman had a baby with a gang member and then dated a member of a rival gang, the first gang would retaliate. Eastside Wemos gang members John Gilbert Alvarado, Alberto De Jesus Ramirez, and Yvonne Hernandez were found guilty with the first degree murder of Rancho San Pedro gang member Jose Pineda. Yvonne Hernandez was also found guilty with the attempt at murder of the woman who was in a relationship with the Rancho San Pedro gang member but whose ex was from Eastside Wemos in the attempt at murder of the party host woman. Yvonne Hernandez was also found guilty with shooting at an occupied motor vehicle. John Gilbert Alvarado and Alberto De Jesus Ramirez were sentenced to state prison for 50 years to life. Yvonne Hernandez was sentenced to state prison for 114 years to life.